because you always have that detached quality. As if you were playing a game without much concern over whether you won or lost. And now that you've lost the game, well, not lost, but just quit playing, you have that rare sort of charm that usually only happens in very old or hopelessly sick people. The charm of the defeated. You look so cool, so cool, so enviably cool. Now the moon has appeared and it's quiet, just beginning to turn a little bit yellow. You were a wonderful lover, <laughs> such a wonderful person to go to bed with. And I think mostly because you were really indifferent to it. Isn't that right? You never had any anxiety about it. Did it naturally, easily, slowly, with absolute confidence and perfect calm. More like opening a door for a lady or seating her at a table and giving expression to any longing for her. Your indifference made you wonderful at lovemaking. Strange, but true. You know, if I thought you would never, never, never make love to me again, I would go downstairs to the kitchen and pick out the longest and sharpest knife I could find and stick it straight into my heart. I swear that I would. But one thing I don't have is the charm of the defeated. My head is still in the ring and I am determined to win. What is the victory of a cat on a hot tin roof? I wish I knew. Just staying on it, I guess, long as she can. Later tonight, I'm going to tell you that I love you, and maybe by that point, you'll be drunk enough to believe me. <laughs>